Hey everybody, <clears throat> welcome back. This is Chef Jose Meyer in my Sun Valley, California kitchen. And, you know, I'm, I, I love Asian cuisine. I've done a bunch of stuff about Chinese and Asian cooking, <clears throat> um, French, Italian, Mexican, barbecue. You know what gets short shrift uh, a lot is German cooking. Uh, there are a lot of recipes out there. My personal favorite is sauerkraut. Uh, had that years ago, and I just loved it. I love the, especially when they make it with, uh, with uh, ginger snaps. <clears throat> um, it takes some effort. There's, you know, it's a special dish. You'll have to, you know, marinate it for a few days. But um, that's that's one thing that I point to. Um, I've also had the opportunity to go to Germany, have some uh, real German food, you know, um, and I, I love it, you know, but it's, it doesn't, you know, it really doesn't, <laughs> it, it's not that popular in the United States, but let's look, I'm, I'm looking in uh, for German recipes, and this is the Dirndl kitchen. Dirndl, if you don't know, is the, the outfit that the women wear, like at Oktoberfest. Um, like the St. Pauli girl, the beer, carrying the beer stuff. So let's look here and see what we can find. You know, yeah, you can make your own pretzels. Uh, stuffed cabbage, that's popular in Europe. Uh, Käse Spätzle, that's uh, German cheese. Spätzle, uh, it's a noodle thing. Uh, German meatballs. Okay, here, this woman... Um, this is, she's wearing a dirndl. So, <laughs> uh, let's see, um, raclette, that's like more, you know, Swiss, I don't know. Um, these are trending German recipes. Let's see what we have. I want to see main courses. <sighs> come on, come on, we're looking for, um, uh, uh, sauerbrot gotta be here if she doesn't have it I'm gonna be disappointed um, you know Austria is close to Hungary so there's some Her Hungarian stuff that uh, gets uh, <clears throat> into uh, into German cuisine um, let's see if we can search um, See what she's got here. You gotta be kidding. German. These are German cooking, and you don't have sauerbraten. Let's just take a look. Kaiserschmarrn. That's a, a Austrian dish. So she's doing some things that aren't um, particularly, you know, totally German. Um, <clears throat> just taking a look here. And I'm not seeing, how can you be a German Döner salad, German Turkish chicken Döner salad? It's not really German. Schnitzel pretzel sandwich. Turkish pizza. Well, you can tell how the Turks are uh, influencing German cooking. But I'm very disappointed. This woman um, has not, does not have a recipe for sauerkraut. But let's look. Oh, homemade German sausage. Let's take a look at that. Um, German bratwurst, okay. Let's see. Pork, bacon, cilantro, chili, garlic, lemon, lime, brown sugar, salt, and pepper, and casings. And you need, uh, um, you need a sausage maker. So, uh, meat grinder and sausage stuffer. Uh, and she uses the attachment for a KitchenAid mixer. So if you're going to do sausages, 
um, you need something like that. So that'll you'll be able to grind your meat and put it in the casings, and um, and then okay, let's try Bavarian potato salad because that's going to go with it. What is German potato salad? With eggs and Vienna sausages. Um, okay, so it's a little different than. <clears throat> um, an American uh, potato salad. Make sure you have the waxy kind, like gold or red potatoes, and, uh, onions, bacon, apples. So it's a little different. Oh, and pickles. Okay, go away. I'm Peter saying. So um, this is Dirndl Kitchen. I would try out these recipes. I'm sure a lot of them are authentic and and that she has cooked in in Germany uh, but I am I am very disappointed that there's no sauerbrot that, that is like the greatest uh, German dish of all time so uh, she's uh, let's see, this is from Bavaria so with an eye on German cooking give it a try this is Jose Meyer. I'm in my Sun Valley, California kitchen, and I will see you all next time. Bon appetit.